When it comes to food, Hawaiian monk seals behave much like dogs. Feed them once and they'll come back for more. That's one of the messages the DLNR Division of Aquatic Resources and NOAA's National Marine Fisheries Service is relaying to fishers who frequent the small bay adjacent to the Kahi Power Plant on Oahu's Waianae coast. We've been getting reports over the last several months of two to three monk seals that have been spending a lot of time in this area. One seal in particular, known by its ID RH32, uh, which has been interacting with fishermen, uh, taking baited fish off of hawks, and uh, generally engaging in a way that is not necessarily healthy for the animal, uh, in that it might be coming uh, habituated to receiving food from humans. A seal that gets food from one fisherman will then try to poach from other hook and line fishermen or spear fishermen, impacting everyone's fishing experience. Fishermen can help each other by not feeding seals. It's also important to know that feeding a seal or attempting to feed a seal or any wild marine mammal for that matter is prohibited under federal law. This is why this week NOAA Fisheries put up a seal safety sign at the entrance to the Kahe fishing area and are stepping up outreach to fishermen. Amlin and a colleague walked the seawalls around the Kahi fishing area and stopped to talk to fishers. They explained the dangers of seal-human interactions and asked fishermen to take a break for a few minutes when a seal is in the area. It didn't take any of your bait or your catch, did it? No, no, no. no just hanging around? There's a few very easy things that fishermen can do. Uh, if you see a seal in the area, if you can take a break for a few minutes and let the seal get bored, move on to another location, that's fantastic. Uh, if the seal does get your bait or part of it, don't throw that fish back in the water because then that seal is receiving food from you and that's an incentive for it to keep coming back. Um, when you, if you do catch a fish and clean it, don't throw the scraps in the water. Again, that's another way that the seal is receiving food from you and is gonna keep coming back. If you see a seal while fishing, or a seal takes your bait or catch, and especially if you think a seal might be hooked, please call the statewide Marine Animal Stranding and Entanglement Hotline at 1-888-256-9840. And really all that does is allow us to come out and respond quickly to make sure that the seal is not injured by the hook um, and help the fishermen provide tools, information, guidelines um, that might prevent that from happening again in the future. All anglers are encouraged to use barbless hooks to avoid seriously injuring a monk seal. Brian Nielsen, acting DAR administrator, said, while we're focusing on the situation at the Kahe Power Plant fishing area, this advice is applicable to anywhere around Hawaii. It's particularly good advice to fishers who stay in one place for extended times. When a seal is in the area, take a break, and hopefully it will move on and avoid any encounters with you or any other people.